well, it's a great celebration of the individuals that uh, have intellectual disabilities and autism that I've known for the greater part of my professional life. And it's a celebration of who they are and how they affect positively all of us uh, by who they are and how they are in the world. And uh, they're unspoiled by prejudice. Uh, so there's no reason why we should have to visit prejudice upon them. And uh, this is uh, more than ceremonial. It's instructive to everyone uh, that being mean and being um, uh, diminishing and destructive is not acceptable. I was gifted with the opportunity to be involved in the disability community when I first got elected by Dave and Trina Lucino at SPIN. And it wasn't a question. They said, you are going to be part of this conversation. And then I championed the issues of funding for the approved private schools. And then uh, we formed the Autism Task Force. And now we are setting standards in Pennsylvania um, for all over the world. And standards are uh, opportunities uh, to uh, bring everybody on the same positive plane. And uh, these individuals with intellectual disabilities um, encourage us to change our definitions of diversity so that we can find opportunities for them that they can perform well at the airport, at the Smithsonian, uh, our wonderful institutions, and really make Philadelphia the first disability-friendly city on the planet.